Sunshine Gang. Hey, bitch. It's your girl, Unapologetically Me, and today, guys, uh, one of my subscribers had um, suggested, had requested that, could I show her how I make my hot water cornbread? And that's what we're doing tonight. It's easy, it's simple, it's two ingredients, and that's it. Nothing else. Okay? So first what you do, you get you some meal. I usually like the plain, without, you know, no self-rising, just plain, but they didn't have it, so I got this. Any kind of do, but I like the plain without, I don't like self-rising in it. Okay, so I just go by my eye. I think about how many pieces of bread I want to make. And actually, no, no, no. Okay. And I normally, guys, I'm going to set this right here about that much. This is a small, the small top Tupperware bowl. About that much, probably about, um, I say right at two cups. And then that's the first ingredient. And then you got your second ingredient. And your second ingredient is just hot water. So you're gonna just pour it over in here. And I will tell you, don't be afraid of the water. Don't be like thinking, oh my God, I put too much water. It's going to be watery. It's meal and it absorbs. So, see how it look? Y'all see how it look? It's really watery. Okay. So then you're just going to stir. I wonder should I bring y'all closer? Think I should. Okay, all that water I just poured in there and it still came out dry looking. So you want to go ahead and you don't want it like that. All of the meal needs to be like blended with the water. It shouldn't be any dry spots. So I just filled the bowl up again. Very simple. The the key to a good hot water cornbread is the consistency of the batter. Once you get that, I'm gonna show y'all the consistency I like, and I don't like it thick because it makes the bread too thick, and I just don't like it like that. Okay. Now. Bigger spoon. So I'm getting this all good and mixed up like so. This right here is too thick. You don't want it that thick. You can, but that's not how I do mine. And when you make it that thick, the bread don't be as I don't know when this. I don't know. Hold on, guys. I got to get some paper towels. Later. So all I gotta say guys is consistency is the key. So all that other talking about this too thick, that too thick, yeah, it's consistency. And I'm gonna show y'all the consistency I make mine. Now at this point this is about a whole pot of water. I'll show y'all the consistency. You want to look for them. I had to learn this myself. I used to just mix up the meal and put the water in there. I didn't know nothing about consistency. I just made sure all of it was like, you want no dry spots, but it was still thick. And I don't know. I just like it when the batter is a little bit more loose. You don't want it too loose though, but. I think this is going to be it right here. I think it could lose. Mm -mm. I think this might be it, guys. 
think this is it. I wonder. Look at this consistency. It kind of like, it's thick, but it kind of like rolls off the, I think this is it. This is the consistency you want to be able to stir it easily and for it to kind of just like, not run off the spoon, but easily, you know. That's the consistency you want. That right there, this right here gonna make some good hot water cornbread, watch. Okay. Be right back. Okay, guys, so now we got the bread all mixed up. Like I said, you want the consistent consistency of the bread to be like that. You don't want it too loose, but you don't want it real thick either. So y'all see that. That's how you want it. That's what makes the good cornbread. Got the aisle over here already heated up, getting ready to get the oil and the skillet on for it. And what you don't want to do, you want to get that grease hot, but you don't want to keep it hot. Okay, guys. So I'll just give me a little saucepan like this. What you you want to go and get that on there? Scoot my greens over a little bit. We can turn that down. That's on how we'll put it on by like eight. To get the grease hot. Okay. And you want. You want to pour enough oil in here. That will. Because when you put the bread in here. It's going to raise a little bit. So you don't want to get it too too full. You just want to put enough where. It uh. Cover the sides a little bit. And while that's heating up, I'ma try gloves, but you need those fingerprints. Your fingers are what make the, the prints that, you know. So that's, we're gonna let that heat up. How have you guys been doing today? I had a good day. I reached a thousand subscribers today and I am super duper excited. I appreciate you guys. Uh, it, it was hard work, and that's what it's all about. But I'm loving that my new subscribers, my old subscribers, all my subscribers, even the ones that are not yet subscribed, I appreciate when you watch my video, comment, you know, or like. It's still much love. So I want to thank y'all, and I'm not going to say too much right now. Because it's, um, I'm just not going to say anything. But anyway, so with all that being said, guys, we're waiting, waiting for this oil. And you'll see it, you know, when it's hot because it starts dancing. That's what I call it, dancing. But you, you'll see it move, you know. It, it's moving. So it's about there. Yeah, it's moving. You'll see it moving. And I'm tell y'all another thing. When you cooking fried chicken, you know how when you batter up that chicken and you pop it in that grease, fresh grease and all that, and it be popping, it be sizzling. And then when it starts to get done, it gets quiet. That's how you know when you fry anything you frying done. When that when that sizzle go, it's done. Okay. You don't want to put it in there too when the grease ain't hot enough because if you do, it's going to start to, you know, make little uh, meal crumbs and stuff. So you want to make sure it's hot. I kind of turned it down on A. I think it's about right now. I can feel that little heat coming up off of there. It's moving around. So we're going to go on and try it. So what you got to do with hot water cornbread, because it's hot, you know it got hot water in it. It ain't calmed down yet. So you have got to run your hand on the cold water before every pack, before every piece. Before you pick up any of it, you have to run your hand in cold water, because this is hot. And then you'll take this, dump it in your hands like that, get your little like this, this is kind of loose, but that's okay. It's kind of loose, but that's the way I like mine. You put it over here. 
come back for more cold water. And I'm gonna tell y'all, actually, this is so kind of loose. All I really gotta do is get a spoon. Like yay big. I'm gonna take and turn this water off. And when it's this loose, like I got it, this is the way I like it though. You really all you really gotta do is just get enough on there. Come over here. Let it fall off in there, tap the pan a little bit. Can do it like that too. That's how I like mine loose like that. That's what makes a good crunchy mouth watering piece of bread, cornbread. So that's how we, cause I mean that's the consistency I like. So it's frying now, guys. You just watch it fry. Y'all want a close up? Sorry about my finger. Yep. And you come over here, you want to see the consistency. Like I said, that right there is the right consistency. You don't want, if it don't fall off the spoon, when you do it like this, maybe with a little shake, it's too thick. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to fry this. That is how I cook hot water cornbread. There you go, guys. I'll bring y'all back when it starts to get done when my first batch is done so y'all can see. Many, many minutes later. Okay, guys. Now it's time to turn the bread. Let me show y'all how it look. It starts getting brown around the edges like that. I turn it. I'm going to turn it. And... One second, I'm sorry for the hands all up in y'all face on me. Y'all hear one of my favorite YouTubers, Brian, DJ TV, y'all. They so damn funny. It ain't even funny. Okay. Okay, guys. So, oh. here you go. And that's how I make my hot water cornbread. Two ingredients, very simple. That's it. Many, many minutes later. Let me show y'all Brian now. They so funny. And I feel like things could be better. Um. Look at Brian, he read the snap. I have a question for your mother. Okay, I kind of have no feeling towards you. They, what? So, they um, funny. yeah, we, we rocking, we cooling, but, um. Okay, you know, that's it, like, y'all. Second batch in. And this is what, that's what's left. Yeah, that's them. There you go. And that's how I make my hot water cornbread. Thanks for watching. I really do appreciate you guys. And we made it to a thousand guys. Deuces. Goodbye.